Why don't RX 580 and GTX 970 play hide and seek together? Because whenever RX 580 counts, GTX 970 is always in the shadow. And now, let us look at 11 critical differences between the two. Let's compare the differences between the AMD Radeon RX 580 and the NVIDIA GeForce GTX 970, two popular graphics cards used in many gaming PCs. Difference 1 refers to the manufacturing company. The RX 580 is manufactured by Advanced Micro Devices, widely known as AMD, while the GTX 970 is a product of the NVIDIA Corporation. These two companies regularly compete in the GPU market, and their philosophy and technology choices can impact card performance. Difference 2 centers around the years of release. The RX 580 was introduced to the GPU market by AMD in April 2017 as a part of their RX 500 series. In contrast, NVIDIA introduced the GTX 970 in September 2014. The three-year gap between their releases suggests advancements in technology for the RX 580. Difference 3 relies on their architecture. The GTX 970 is built using the Maxwell architecture, while the RX 580 uses AMD's Graphics Core Next, GCN architecture. These architecture differences can impact overall performance, efficiency, and features offered by the GPUs. Difference 4 involves shader processing units. The RX 580 has 2304 units, while the GTX 970 has 1664. This means the RX 580 can process more information at a given time, leading to better performance in games and applications that utilize these units. Difference 5 concerns their texture mapping units, TMUs. The AMD RX 580 has 144 TMUs, while the NVIDIA GTX 970 has 104 TMUs. More TMUs lead to better texture filtering, allowing the RX 580 to render images more efficiently. Different 6 outlines their render output units, ROPs. The RX 580 has 32 ROPs, compared to the GTX 970 which has 56 ROPs. Higher number of ROPs can provide the GTX 970 with a small advantage in rendering pixels to the screen in certain scenarios. Different 7 elaborates on memory. The RX 580 has 8 GB GDDR5 memory, while the GTX 970 has 4 GB GDDR5. This means the RX 580 has double the VRAM, an advantage when running games at higher resolutions or with large texture files. Difference 8 details the memory bus width. The RX 580 has a memory bus width of 256 bits, while the GTX 970 has a unique memory design featuring a 224-bit plus 32-bit configuration. Generally, wider memory buses can transfer data more efficiently. Difference 9 clarifies power requirements. The RX 580 requires more power to operate at an estimated peak of 185 watts, as compared to the GTX 970, which requires around 145 watts. This is an important consideration for the power supply unit in a gaming PC build. Difference 10 pertains to the DirectX support. While both GPUs support DirectX 12, the RX 580 observes a marginally higher version, 12 underscore 0, than the GTX 970, 12 underscore 1, potentially providing a bit more compatibility and better performance in newer games. Difference 11 centered around the manufacturing process. The RX 580 is manufactured using a 14NM process, while the GTX 970 uses a 28NM process. The newer technology in the RX 580 allows it to deliver the same performance as the GTX 970 while consuming less power.